Hi, I'm Kelsey Brennan Wessels, and welcome back to Earth from Space on the European Space Agency Web TV. Ecuador's northern highlands are pictured in this image from the Envisat satellite. This area is part of the northern zone of the Andean volcanic belt. The belt was formed as a result of the Nazca and Antarctic tectonic plates moving under the South American plate, a geological process called subduction. Now near the top left of the image, the southern outskirts of Ecuador's capital, Quito, appear as white dots. Quito is the highest capital city in the world, at an elevation of over 2,850 meters above sea level. Near the bottom left corner is the Cotopaxi stratovolcano. It is the second highest summit in the country, at 5,900 meters, and is one of Ecuador's most active volcanoes, erupting more than 50 times since the early 1700s. On the center-right side of the image is the Antisana volcano. What look like white glaciers at the peaks of these mountains are actually artifacts of the radar echo. The surface of the summits are more or less directly facing the satellite, so the radar signal reflects straight back up to the antenna. This image was created by combining three NVSAT radar passes from June 4th of 2006, January 20th of 2008, and January 24th of 2010 over the same area. Colors represent changes in the land surface between the three radar scans that make up this composite image. Some of the changes are distinct, such as the patchwork showing changes in agricultural plots near the top left. From Antisana to the west, the area is generally colorful, indicating ground movement. But east of Antisana, the area is less colorful and therefore more stable. The Envisat satellite was launched 12 years ago on March 1st of 2002. After 10 years in orbit, contact with the satellite was lost in April of 2012, and the end of the mission was declared one month later. But even today, Envisat's archived data continue to be exploited for studying our planet. And that brings us to the end of this edition of Earth from Space. Remember that we broadcast online every Friday at 10 o'clock Central European Time. Watch us on our website or through the ESA app on your mobile device. From the ESA Web TV Studios, I'm Kelsey Brennan-Wessels.